This is Bellatro, a fascinating fusion of poker, jokers, and the tried and tested roguelite style run. My name's Suge, and allow me to introduce you to your next card based obsession. Let's delve in. You start by picking your standard, completely normal 52 playing card deck. You are presented with three ascending rounds of play small blind, big blind, and boss blind. You need to overcome these three blinds in order to make it to the next ante, or progression level. Entering your first blind, a round of Volatro starts with your hand drawn, but instead of rounds of betting, checking or folding in a game of deception, you can choose up to five cards to put forward. You then have the choice to play your hand, or discard and redraw in an effort to form your best poker rank. You can assess your hand at any time and view available poker ranks if you forget them. To the left, you can see the current plays and discards remaining, but also the most important part of the run, the combo total. As your hand is scored, the chip total is in blue, and the multiplier, or multi-total, is in red. The better the poker rank, the higher the base combo, and the higher the individual card rank, the more chips they also add to this combo. The goal of this is to beat the chip total for the blind to progress. Initially, you'll find that you need a decent set of ranks to squeeze past that 300 chip total. The higher blind seems inconceivable at first glance, but that's where the special twist comes into play. Jokers. In this game, there are a staggering amount of different jokers, and these are essential to boost the combo total. You can give advantage to certain card suits, or poker ranks, and many more possibilities. Rewarding you with chips, adding to the multiplier, or even multiplying the current multiplier. But you only have room for five jokers, so choose wisely. When the stars align, you can really rattle off the combos, and if you hit a great one, the numbers really start cooking. At the end of a round, based on you meeting the blind total and the amount of hands you have remaining, and of course interest for every five dollars you already had, you can spend your hard earned dollars in the shop. Here you have available jokers for purchase, but also tarot cards, because why not? These are one-time triggers that power up cards, but as with the jokers, there is so much more they can do as well. There are also planet cards. You may have previously noticed numbers to the left of the poker ranks. These denote levels, and planets will increase your base combo for a corresponding rank. You can store two of any combination of these on the playing field, for instant use or for when they are most advantageous. For some random spice, there are booster packs which give you extra options, such as the standard pack for augmenting your deck with more cards, some of them bearing special tricks. The final card type, Spectral, can usually only be found in Spectral boosters, granting higher effects typically at much greater risk and sacrifice. The final item is the vouchers, which you can purchase once per ante and, although pricier, they give a permanent advantage without taking up vital slots. Now then, here's the big twist. You don't have to play the small or big blinds at all. You can simply skip them if you feel confident enough. Doing so gives you a randomised tag, which can be many things from a free booster to perks in your next shop visit such as a powered up joker. You do however have to beat the boss blind in card combat, there's no skipping that one. This always has a special rule that restricts card play such as debuffing all cards in one suit, rendering their abilities and the joker triggers useless. Or perhaps giving you the cards face down, which is also not overly helpful. And it's happened more than once that I've forgotten to check the special rule and fallen prey to its tricks. There are many incredible synergies in this game for you to discover. Whatever you fancy, this game will keep you coming back for more, hungry to find new angles and styles to defeat the run. If you fancy yourself a bit of a card shark and are excited by this, pick up Bellatro and I promise you'll find your own slice of heaven. Subscribe if you want to find more gems for your Steam Deck. Thanks for watching to the end, and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.